I'm Ken Coleman and welcome to Daily Doodles 26. Today I am going to show you a character for my new Patreon series, The Furriest Fick. And I had been thinking about her last night, trying to figure out exactly what type of character she'd be, what type of character her culture would be. And I was thinking about flying squirrels. So the the first thing that came to mind was the wingsuits that people are starting to wear when skydiving and free falling. It's a very much an extreme sport. And I was trying to figure out how to make that work. So I need to diminish that. Yeah. That way. So I was trying to figure out the anatomy. I was looking at pictures on Google of flying squirrels how I'd take that idea and turn it into something anthropomorphic. So I had an idea, I had an idea of the body. You could have arms. Which could be more or less athletic. Big muscular legs. And something that I noticed about the squirrels, the flying squirrels particularly, are that they have these big, huge eyes, and their eyes are so cute. So if the eyes could be like that, And finding some way to maybe not so much a superhero build, but And if I had something cute and something a little softer, Yeah, could come out.
famously bushy tail of squirrels. These are probably some of the strongest ideas so far. Something that I really wanted from them was that they be extreme athletes. So that if I had the face here, squirrely cheeks, And eyes here ish with the ears. I could put goggles along there. Sort of like how skiers wear goggles and old World War One fighter pilots. And it would hide the size of the eye. But also protect their face. I was also trying to think of how the wingsuit would operate and how regular clothes would operate while keeping them clothed. And I was thinking that they could be nudist by nature, nudist by culture. That is the that allows the webbing, the flaps of skin, to hang low when needed. But I'd make it loose enough so that if they're wearing shirts, if they wear loose-fitting clothing, it could fit in underneath the sleeve and underneath the shirt. It would look confining, but I imagine that nudists, I think, I think nudists may feel just that when they're wearing these, when they're forced by convention to wear clothes. So they would wear this and when it comes to their flight suits, there would be a layer of fabric going over the, the wings. So that's it for Daily Doodles for today. Trying to lightly color this. The idea for 
clothing for flying squirrels is something that I spent a lot of time thinking about yesterday. Not sure how often people are thinking about clothing for flying squirrels. I may be a pioneer. <laughs> it's going to be much more clothing than uh, Rocky wore. And I'm going to leave that to what I'm guessing will be the second week of the comic to explore what our aerial artist culture of the furries fic world will be wearing. Well, this has been Daily Doodles. Daily Doodles 26. I'm Ken Coleman, and thank you for watching. If you like this video, However short it is, and however just spitballing ideas this may be, please give it the thumbs up. There will be a link to the Patreon website where I have yesterday completed a promo piece of mice who own a uh, food uh, who own a food truck. So, any comments below? Always welcome. Good one.